June. Can you say bye? I miss you already. What? I miss you already. <laughs> All right, here's the situation. I have three shows in the Northwest this weekend. Just got out of Lyft, realized my phone's in the Lyft. I don't have my cell phone. All right. We'll see how this goes. We now welcome our I left my cell phone on the lift. No, you didn't. I need your phone right now. A few moments later. You ran back to get your phone with my phone, which was a problem because I couldn't get on the flight. Also, the problem is I can't run. I have a strained Achilles right now. Strained Achilles. I have not moved that fast on this leg. I will honestly say that I forgot all about your Achilles. I don't like the smirk that he has on his face. It doesn't make me feel good, but I made it. That's the important thing. There are good people in this world. I'm, look at it. Fourth quarter, Shaq at the free throw line. That is what this is. Show goes on. Hopefully smooth from here on out. Two hours later. Just getting to Ben. Two hour flight, super easy. My buddy Matt is going to be picking us up. Matt and his family are kind of the reason why I'm in Ben. Also, Matt knows I'm a huge pizza nerd, so he's going to take us on a quick pizza tour before the show. This is Matt. What up? Matt, are you from Bend? No, I'm from San Diego. Dude. That's what I thought. That's right. I will say I did not warn Matt that the camera was going to be directly in his face and right. I'd be asking questions. So do you care if I ask you, you're going to be on my video? Sure. Okay. I just got permission. The bed. It's an interesting land landscape. It's a lot of rural, but it's also like these little pockets of resort. First place we're going to go to is called Pine Martin. It's a uh, it's at a little food cart lot called the In the Bite of Tumalo, and it's got like a western theme to it. But they have a bunch of really great carts. And the guy that started this cart does wood fired pizzas right out of the back of it, and it's it's phenomenal. Cheers, brother. Cheers, brother. Cheers, cheers, cheers. cheers. <laughs> yeah. It's fantastic. Fan freaking tastic. Come get this pizza. We're going to Abe Cabana's. It's a Detroit style pizza. So, if you have not had um, legit Detroit pizza in your life, if like if right now you're going what's Detroit pizza seek it out in your city not from a chain find a uh, independent spot that does it you'll thank me later you'll DM me and go thank you for that recommendation Rui have you had Detroit before I have not had real Detroit that I'm aware of because I had it from a place that I can't remember and it wasn't a chain but I don't remember the place so it didn't stick with me little, so I'm treating this Caesars. like my first was imagine it? it was little Caesars <laughs> imagine it better not have been no, little, little Caesars, Caesars. Is, that's that's just for the hot and ready. Fun fact, Carlene and I almost broke up one time because um, she told me her favorite pizza was Little Caesars. That was early in dating, and I was like, I think this is a this is turning kind of a big red flag. <laughs> yo yo yo! Yeah, that's a pretty good looking shirt. Not bad. I would huh? say. <laughs> that's another good looking shirt. <laughs> cool dad alert right here. Cool dad right there. Headed out. First show of the weekend. Really, me. Silver Moon Brewery tonight. It's about a 10 minute walk. My leg is still effed up and I ran a 5K through the San Diego airport this morning, so we'll see how long it takes to get to the... We'll see. Decided to get a $7 lift instead. Yay! I'm gonna preserve the foot. <laughs> if I was off, I'd give you a free ride. Oh my God. <laughs> If she was off, she'd give us a free... Damn it! Take a 10 minute break.
got my names on it, dog. Let's go. What's happening? Before I move on, do any of you, as I'm bringing up this material, do any of you guys remember a lie from your childhood that your parents told you that stuck with you for your entire life? Never gave the bird. <laughs> I love your mom. Oh my God. That's if you didn't hear, when she, how old were you? Seven. When she was seven years old, her mom said, if you give the bird to somebody, a man is going to come shake his wiener in your face. <laughs> oh my God. I love that. You guys have been awesome. I love all of you. My name is Mel Hall. Thank you so much. <laughs>